Let's talk a little bit about timing for a second here, because usually when I see people in lessons or whatnot start to get a bit of a sense of this, the club feels, in a sense, out of control. It's got so much movement and energy and they think, how am I going to time this? First off, golf is a game of, there's a lot of timing in golf. You're never going to get rid of that. Now, momentarily, this final segment, we're going to look at firming up impact and how to really make this square up against the golf ball. That's our final piece. But just to touch on timing, if you picture fishing, I've done a tiny bit of it. I've watched it on TV, say an expert fisherman sees the fish are biting there, they pop the rod with just the right pop to send the lure and land it. A really good fisherman on TV can land it pretty darn accurately at a relative distance. That's more like what you're trying to do with this. You're not in a full shot trying to just control the club. As I say, we'll touch on impact here in the final segment. You're trying to time your stroke like a fisherman, so you pop, get the most out of it and the most solid contact right where you need it.